Hi, today I'll show you how I made this rope mirror for about $20. The supplies I used are this 14 inch mirror I purchased from Michaels. I used a 40% off coupon so I ended up paying about $4. Uh, this rope was about $5 from Walmart, some hot glue gun, and adhesive nails. I also purchased this sheet of MDF board from Home Depot and that was about $4 as well. I measured and marked a circular pattern around the mirror and using a jigsaw I cut out the circular pattern. I flipped the mirror over and here I'm removing the felt pads that were attached to the mirror. There's going to be about three an three inch space where I'll um, put the glue for the rope. And before I glue the mirror down, I'm going to hammer in these metal picture hangers. I'm going to use this liquid nails adhesive to here, adhere the mirror and I recommend using this strong adhesive rather than just hot glue because you don't want the mirror crashing down. After I applied the mirror I noticed the nail from the picture hanger was poking through the back so I had to remove the mirror and hammer down the nail that was poking through. It takes about 20 minutes for the glue to dry. I just place some heavy books on the top and let it set for about 30 minutes. Time to glue the rope down. I simply am using some scissors just to taper the rope so it can start off with a smooth point. Placing a dab of hot glue, I'll just begin gluing the rope to the board. And this is a high temperature hot glue gun, so I'm going to use the edge of my scissors to hold the rope in place while the glue dries. And I'll follow along the edge of the mirror, making my way around. Here I'm about halfway through and I will continue gluing the rope down. At this point there was not enough rope to finish the mirror so I took the jigsaw and just removed about half an inch of the wood all the way around. And lastly to finish I will glue the rope around the raw edge of the wood just to give it a finished look. Hang and enjoy. Thanks for watching.